Hello everyone, this is Daphne on back with another YouTube video. And in this brief video, I'm just gonna show you how to use your S Pen to use the Smart Select tool that's within the error commands on certain steps and tablets and uh, phones. And what the Smart Select tool does is it grabs text and images that um, you can annotate, write, draw, make little notes on, and then you can share it with whoever you need to share it with, or if you need to share it with another device or whatnot. It's great for note taking, whether you're a student or you know a business person who's doing research. And I'm gonna let the video speak for itself because it explains it better than I can. And what I did here is I went to, where did I go to? Internet browser. And put in why is the sky blue? This is just for this example. I'm pretending you're researching why the sky is blue. You can be researching whatever you want. But you hover your S Pen over your device and a little S Pen symbol will come up and then it'll bring up your error commands. And then you choose smart select. And then you can either lasso crop or you can do a square crop, but I'm gonna do a lasso crop because I'm just, I just want to get the text. Like if you want to get a picture or something along with the text, the square crop probably would be better than the lasso. And what it does is it basically takes a screenshot of what you selected. And then you can use the pen option to do your annotation, write your little notes, whatever it is you need to do. And it also gives you the option to pin this. So like if you were taking notes within the Samsung Notes app, you can have this text pinned somewhere. So you could take notes off of what's pinned on your screen. If that makes sense, it's kind of hard to explain what I'm saying. Uh, but yeah, you can extract the text to give you the option to extract any text that you select too, where you know it copies and you can paste it somewhere. And here you can save the image or you can share it with whomever you want to share it with after you're done your annotations. Or you can share it with another device if you need to share it with another device. I'm gonna just back out of that. I'm not gonna save it. And I'm gonna show you how you can also do this with a video say um you're doing research and you're watching a video and you need to take a clip from the video and take some notes on that little clip from the video or like if you're a student and your teacher's doing a lecture or something a video lecture and you need to take something from that video lecture this is what you would do and i'm just going to youtube and then i'm gonna go to my channel and i'm gonna ch uh, click on my latest video which is about linking your phone to your pc i'm just doing this for uh, this tutorial an example for this tutorial but I click on the video and let's just say there's a section in this video I got to enlarge it but let's say there's a section in this video that I want to share with you know a friend a colleague or something like that and I want to write notes on that section too as well so I, so I can further explain my idea or whatever it is you hover your pen back over your device you let the air command come up select smart tool as well like I did before this time I'm doing the square smart select instead of the lasso and say there's something up here like I want to tell them about the address that they need to go to or the instructions you know I just use the pen and then you can change your pen style as well and change your pen color here and just write whatever little notes I need to write on it and then after I'm done I can either save it or I can share it with that person and that's basically what smart select is I'm backing out I'm not saving it um I hope this video helped someone who didn't quite understand what the smart select tool is we have made it to the end if you made it this far i appreciate it please hit that like and subscribe button for me if you have not already and i will see you guys in the next one bye